All right, people, welcome back. More are DM Doe commentary, so we are joined by Lunar. Yo. He actually showed up on time for this, at least. Yeah, I know, right? <laughs> anyway, uh, we have Graf here, who I'm not sure if you're playing Burning Abyss, but his opponent is. <laughs> Graf72 <laughs> and 1001 in, I guess, New York Jet. <laughs> I guess it's New York Jet yes. 089 yes. at 1096. Is that... Football, baseball. I am no. I'm not into sports. I don't know. <laughs> I'm not. I'm not into sports, let alone American sports. <laughs> so uh, you might be seeing a little bit of that burning abyss action. Uh, Beatrice has now officially come out in the TCG. So uh, maybe we'll be seeing some of them shenanigans. <laughs> mm-hmm. And uh, still waiting on that ban list. <laughs> <laughs> If we could go ahead and get that, hopefully Dante doesn't get hit down to one. I I, I think OCG took that way too extreme. What do you think? Mm. Like one, what do you do with one Dante in Burning Abyss? <laughs> exactly, not much. Hope you recycle it. Mm. Oh, Play have... in tour bus. <laughs> Put it back. <laughs> have you uh, oh. have you saw uh, Lithium Twenty Three Hundred's uh, Nirvana plays with uh, the Odd Eyes deck? Oh no, I haven't. Oh, it? it's pretty much a you know like the the pendulum magician synchro yeah. uh, bust out media burst. Oh yeah. Then you just summon a centric in which uh, a pendulum monster is treated as a tuner yeah. despite not being a tuner. There's Nirvana right there. I was like, oh shit! Oh. <laughs> so just burst from a centric art fiends in your uh, your pendulum magician odd eyes deck, and you can bust out Nirvana. <laughs> nice. Wow, centric really went down in price. Like, oh my god, just. That infinite gold, so good. I can't believe it's gonna be a com a common. Yeah, though. A common. Yeah, like, yeah. Oh my it's god. Crazy. <laughs> like probably the best card in that starter deck. Alright, so we are seeing uh, Zephra, Zephra Yangzing. I'm guessing, or just just Zephra. Nice. Yep, Zephra Yangzing. Until we get them uh, Metaphosis. I kind of mm. wanted to play that on Daily Duel with Metaphosis yeah. uh, Yangzing, but oh well. Oh, but I, I thought you hated Metal Forces. <laughs> nah, they're a nice enabler. I just Every don't like I them play... by themselves. Because oh, you I... sit there and do nothing. Because well, like, uh, It seems like you're playing a pure lucky. variant. Yeah. yeah, no, it seems like you're playing a pure variant. It seems like of you sit course. there doing nothing. No, you do do stuff. I just, like, it's crazy because, like, summon, like, freaking four fusions in one turn on, like... Like just playing online, and mm -hmm. then as soon as I go into a tag with you, just break hey. every time. <laughs> so so far, you're not impressing me. Maybe in Yang Zings or or some enabler. It, it like, does. Re it really does work well, with Yang Zing. Yeah, you know, I mean, why mine as well? Just replace uh, the the Sky Arc engine and just replace it with that. Pretty much, it's the same thing, except with more enabling. You don't have to rely on your fail spell, your pendulum scales will handle it, and you can pendulum summon between 1 and 8. Which I guess in here it's not bad, you can still pendulum between, between what, 1 and 7. I guess in the Magician variant you could do it too. But then you get to fuse and stuff, and put your cards back, pop your own shit, get your own searches. So good. Ah, <sighs> that Baxia spin, so strong. <laughs> Spinning back to the deck. Yep, yep. So, what is the fact that he have? He can't be destroyed a battle, and he gained 500 attacks. So, he's 2,800 monster, can't be destroyed a battle. Alright. <laughs> so we are just seeing a couple of the... Uh, uh, the infinite gold cards. I don't know what Beatrice would do right now. Are you gonna go in Dante? Maybe I can... I don't know. Just go on the defensive? Mill somewhere, I guess? Detach that, sir. Oh, there's Farf. Oh, man, you could have got that direct attack in. Was that freaking ultimate, uh... Was that, what was that trap I didn't... Yeah, I think it's, uh... What was it called again? I mean, Final Provenance or something like that. The one where if a spell trap or monster effect is activated, you discard uh, a card of the same type and negate and destroy it. Oh, was it? I don't know. I think that's what it was. Oh, man, you're missing out on 2,500 right now, but I guess you couldn't know if you are going to mill the uh, Farfa or not for yeah. Vaxia. Wow, downered. Kind of thought yeah. maybe you would go into that Beatrice, though. <laughs> Where's Beatrice? 
the whole point of the revival of of uh, Burning the Abyss is with Beatrice. Like, besides, if you're not doing that, then I guess you could just... Does his uh, attack get reset if you left the field? Uh, I believe it does. And he can be destroyed now. Yeah, he can be destroyed. I think I think that if it it's removed from the field, then I believe it's... Uh, its bonus effects drop off. I think. I'm not 100% sure. That doesn't happen. Yeah, really I'm not sure on that either. Because I swear there's some finicky ruling that it doesn't work with Yang Yi. Like, it will keep the effects, but I don't know. Logic Monsters. would dictate it lost them. A synchro monster that was used as a synchro summon gains the attack. It just didn't say on the field. So, the monster that was used as a synchro summon is still on the field and still has. The equips. I believe that's how it works from what is read off of uh, the materials. Okay. So, I mean, he kind of went really in busting out that, that Baxia, but now what? Your pendulum scales aren't really doing anything, are they? Not really. Just, you can only pendulum summon Ying Zing or Zephyr. Monsters. Yep. So back to the effect, select your target in the graveyard. In turn, you could target one card you control on one level. Yeah, you didn't announce what your target in the graveyard is, sir. <laughs> oh, well. Yeah, once per turn, you could target one card you control and one level four lower monster in your graveyard, semicolon. Yeah. <laughs> so, summon back. Beyond pool, pool effect. Oh, and Suwani effect? No, wait, no. Suwani effect? No. You mean Pulau effect? Beyond effect, Pulau effect, she went eff Oh no. I fucking hate Yang Zing so much. <laughs> <laughs> so Pulau will summon the Zephra. She won't summon itself, and Baxia summoning the, the Beyond. Oh my god. If I'm not talking about Yang Zings, then I'm just, it has to sound like I'm having an aneurysm. Just blah, 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 blah. Okay. So summon that to, I guess, banish and negate. Any monster that's set from the hand or main deck is banished instead of that power. And you just summon Zephra just so when it's gone, you can go ahead and get a search. Oh, yep, same question. That's a left of field. I believe it loses the buffs. I'm not sure. I guess we could search it up. Hmm. Let me do that right now. <laughs> do young things lose? Find it? I'm looking at it right now. Fafa versus. Oh, this is Fafa versus Jin. That doesn't help me. If, Synchro Monst if the Synchro Monster was banished temporarily and returned, then all previous ending effects applied will be removed. Ah, cool. Okay. That helps then. <laughs> Yeah, that Herald cannot be destroyed by battle. But he has piercing damage, so yeah, he has that piercing, though. Gonna go ahead and detach. <laughs> Ooh. Did he detach? He I... didn't yet. Okay. I don't think. Okay. Yeah, there we go. Seems that you're now, what, 23? Yeah, 23. Dante Effect. It just says from the main deck or hand or main deck, so. Detaching. Go ahead and get your card back. It's all good. So that Herald, though, is that, it seems like it's just intentionally meant to just fuck up graveyard shit. <laughs> just hand in main deck. It's not even field. Just hand in main deck. That's crazy. <laughs> it's like, hey, I heard you like milling, so fuck you. Mm. Like, you wouldn't even fuck up, like, what? Cosmos? It's out. The same shit. Oh no, chicken game. Ew, you're gonna leave that on the field? <laughs> oh, 
Hopefully you get something to switch that out. I wouldn't even be playing, man. I hate leaving chicken game there. Hmm. At least it's not meta. I'm kind of sick and tired of seeing meta. Uh... Non mm -hmm. So is this even Zephyr Yang Zings or is it just Yang Zings? No, uh, it's got Zephyr in, so I don't think it's got any other Zephyrs in, but okay. I would still classify it as Zephyr Yang Zing because most of the time Yang Zings don't run the Zephyrs. Okay. Well, I think they, they normally run like the big one. I think the like one, that one of them. Just a search for your uh yeah, Your I think they run like just, just one of him. Okay. Sure like they used to the... run just one of two T or whatever his name was. To... Yeah, then I'll make but sure now they run put... none. Zephyr Yang Zing's in the title. I'm gonna go ahead and go after him, I guess. You don't take any damage. Now what? I'm trying. I'm trying to figure out where you're going with this. And I Watch guess have, uh... in this card, Strobe Ooh. Battle by card effect while in the monster zone. So he did, did he get uh, his Pendulum Monster effect, or he doesn't get that? Ten, maybe? He's gonna go into it... a ten? Maybe. What, like a Leo or something? Oh, okay, he's gonna Pendy. Okay. Yes. Okay, he's gonna make another Faxia. Oh, now you get its effects. Okay. I mean, them pendulum scales are putting in that work right now. Mm-hmm. <laughs> it's been a long time since I've seen Zephyr. Yep, pendulum... Yang Zing Zephyr. Oh, wow. Yep, definitely, definitely Zephyr. Yeah. <laughs> But you won't be having a face-up Zephyr anymore, unless you're doing something different. Yeah, he's sinking into Baxia. Yeah. I thought you were going to get, like, creation or path. No, he's not about that life. So, was that spin two? That's two. Target, I guess, your set card, your two back row, I guess? Hmm. <laughs> Your sir and your one set card. Okay, all right. Gone. I wonder how long this uh, this Dando commentary is going to be because we have some of the floatiest decks in all of Yu-Gi-Oh yeah. dueling each other. Yeah. Well, this man just keeps whipping out the Herald. Oh, switch it out. Oh, Baxia is it once per turn. Well, it's once per turn, but it's not. You can only use the effect of Baxia once per turn. Nice. All right, so I'll get rid of that chicken game. Not bad, not bad. I see, I see you, I see you, Graf. <laughs> it's not like New York Jets can really do much with that, uh, with that downer on the field. Should have went into Beatrice. <laughs> Wow, still playing Galaxy Cyclone. When you're playing Burning Abyss, who would love to go ahead and be pitched for cost for Twin <laughs> Twisty. Like, alright, sure. Maybe I'm the crazy one. <laughs> oh, if I was playing Burning Abyss, there would be triple Twin Twister up in there. Like, let's go. <laughs> well, I guess milling. I guess. You already know how much maybe, I love Maybe twisters. against the Pendulum meta. Yeah, I guess you could side it. Gonna go ahead and pierce Harold one more time. Now what? It cannot attack if it doesn't have materials or something. I think it just doesn't do piercing. Let's oh. see. Attack this card. I guess it can still just do everything. This card can two and track when it the material. This card attack. Fixed damage to your opponent. This card attack the damage attack with attack with damage. Oh yeah, I guess so. So, I guess it still no, does everything. No damage, bro. All right. <laughs>
that it was like yeah. like acid going where it doesn't have any extreme materials, it can't attack, but nope. I thought it just lost piercing, but... <laughs> Time to summon, get to search. Go into another one? Another? <laughs> another one. Another one. Another bad Do it. Do it. Spin that and that. Spin and the two sets and then, like, go. pretty much win. Yeah, you pretty much win. Another one? Yeah, Another wow. one. <laughs> Ooh. Who oh, said, oh, guy. Yeah, and who said that Yang Zeng's was the weak deck of the Doris Alliance era? <laughs> so everybody go to attack, and that should be game, right? Well, maybe. No, that's not game. He needs a little bit more. It's only, what, 5th? 46? And he's only getting 200 for that, 48, 600, no, that's not a game. Ah, the powerful path, though. <laughs> Seems like Yang Zings will never win on the polls. <laughs> mm. Waiting for that ally of justice. Ew. Get out of here. <laughs> I think they're possibly the worst deck in the game. <laughs> Even worse than Ice Barriers? I'd say so. In fact, Ice Barriers, not actually too bad. It's because uh, the big one has the same stats as a Monarch, so you can use the Monarch cards in the deck. Mm. Which is pretty funny. Summon Tribute Pop. Now that's game. Yep, alright. We're going to go ahead and go to game two. Be right back. It's all over. Alright people, back for game two. So, New York Jets went first, set two cards. Uh, at least you don't have to worry about getting fire liked at least. So, Graf, are you going to go ahead and set up the Pendant Scales and go off again? <laughs> that, that was, was pretty lucky getting both scales. Mm -hmm, that, was, that was pretty amazing. Whoa. Ooh -hoo -hoo. Again? Another one? Oh! Oh, he is playing Zephyr. Yep. yep. Oh yeah, Ultimate there it Providence. is. There so, it is. It's a spell to stop a spell. And what the hell was the card with that? I didn't get to see it, damn it. It was Shuffle Reborn. What does that do? Uh, it lets you Monster Reborn, pretty much, but uh, then the monster returns to your deck at the end of the turn, but then you can also shuffle a card from your field. While it's in your graveyard, shuffle a card from your field back into the deck to draw a card and banish it from your grave. I think... <laughs> Yeah, let's see. Uh, let me go ahead and actually look at this. That card. that second effect is right, but I don't remember the first one too much. Because what you're saying, it sounds busted. If you control no monsters, you can target one monster in your graveyard, special summon it, but its effects are negated, also banish it during the end phase. Yeah, okay. Well, the other effect is uh, the okay. one that I remember. You can banish this card from a graveyard, then target one card you control, shuffle it into your deck, and yeah, draw one card during the end phase of this turn, banish one card from your hand. Yeah. I'm about to say, because that sounds busted as fuck. Hey, I was kind of right. I would use that, that freaking Doom Shaman and shit. Just go ahead and target Doom Shaman, summon it, but its effects weren't negated. Banish it during yeah. that phase, but I'm going to Synchro Summon with it anyway, so. So it's just going to go right back to the graveyard, but no. <laughs> its effects are negated. <laughs> I guess, if that's what you want to do. Oh my god. Catch this Trishula, man. <laughs> I thought he was gonna have to go into Chow Feng, but nah, fucking Trishula. I guess you didn't want to fuck with the vanities. Okay. <laughs> what did you want in there? I mean, there's literally nothing in that graveyard. Oh, I guess Shuffle Reborn can do something later, so. Wow, mass change second. This man's trying to fuck you up with the dank claw. Did he draw some Maxi? I guess I think he did. And Trish hit the field? I wasn't really paying attention. <laughs> um, You're not even paying attention. No, I'm not. Someone's messaging me. I'm trying I to tell him to bugger off. I can hear it. <laughs> 
Come on, New York Jets, you're playing Burning Abyss, man! Summon Skarm, I mean, you don't have any backers, you can special summon now, yeah, I summon that Farf. Hmm, response? Yes, the reveal, response? Nah, nah, no wait, don't you have to have a face up on the field, right? I'm special for them, then you banish one Zephyr monster in your graveyard. Why did I think he was kind of like, um... Oh my god, what's the Yang Zing card? I mean, not the Yang Zing card, the Yusenju card? Uh, sorry, say again. Uh, I'm paying attention okay, now. What's the, what's the Yusenju uh, counter trap? Uh, secret technique or whatever. Yeah, okay, I keep on thinking that strike was like secret technique where you had to control a Zephyr monster. No, you just banish one for, uh, Zephyr monster in your extra deck. Fuck him up. Yep. Trap. Let's go. Wow. You have my graph is divided attention. Up. Graph is fucking up the no, I don't. I can still hear the sound. Well yeah, I'm still being messaged for the I'm not responding now. They said didn't you say don't message me? <laughs> I <laughs> did. <laughs> and he's still messaging you. I hear you typing. I'm sorry. For <laughs> <laughs> real now. He won't listen. Just ignore him. <laughs> We have to keep this a strict level of professionalism here on the channel. You're not even gonna take me seriously. <laughs> Does he get some effect of a synchro summon when he summoned it? Did he even do that with Oracle? I don't think he did. Well, a ritual monster using a separate monster. So what the uh oh the oracle isn't it mandatory? Is it mandatory? No, you can activate oh, this okay. effect depending on the summon. Say, so, like, is this man about to put a choose a monster and top of his deck? I actually got fucked up by that one time when I was playing Tower Turbo. He actually did that, placed uh 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 Santa Claus on top of his deck, then played Upstart, and then got rid of my yeah, tower. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I was like, oh shit. <laughs> Oh, a majesty fiend. So, I guess Fiendish Rhino and. What was that? Who was that other one? Libic or something like that? I didn't even get to really see. Well, the uh, dragon guy. Oh, that was Drag. Drag. Dragna? Dragwell or whatever his name is? I don't know his name, but it was that. Ah, guy. there's Graf. Gotta use Graf versus Graf, right? Mm hmm. <laughs> and then, sir. Run over that Swanee, who will of course float. <laughs> who you gonna summon with Swanee? Oh, Chiwan? Chiwan's there? I didn't even see Chiwan. I guess he was here earlier in the duel. Isn't that during the damage step? Yeah, what? Did he just drop Maxi? Yeah. Hello? He's a crazy man. Uh, hello, New York. New York Jet. How do you max C? Oh my god. During damage step. Hello? Wait, was it damage step or was it just battle phase? He attacked, killed the monster, then Sawani goes off during the damage step. How do you max C during damage step? It wasn't an attack decoration. It was when Sawani. It went Sawani effect and Chiwan effect during the damage step. They both go off during the damage step, right? After the monster is killed and the damage is done. So how do you drop Maxi on that? Hmm. Oh, whatever. Maybe I'm wrong. I I don't know. I don't know how. Now, if you want to attack Maxi, I don't know when damage step ends. To be honest, I is believe, that like? I believe it's after the, the monsters float, because it's like cards like Armadius, like cards can't be active until the end of the damage step, which. Of course, oh yeah, with a, like yeah. A, a maybe that would make no sense. Flow. Yeah, that makes so, sense. That's still during the damage step, so yeah, yeah, how, yeah. how do you max in during the damage step? <laughs> Crazy. Now, if you went attack and attack decoration maxi, sure. <laughs> Let's just pretend he did that. All right, all right, all right. We'll just pretend that he did that, everybody. <laughs> Zook signature. I'll just tour guide. So. Dante effect. Get something back. 
And once again, this busting out that powerful Herald of Arc Light. It seems like he just intentionally put that in there for Burning Fist. Or maybe like Phantom Knights or something. It won't, it won't work versus Cosmos. I know that. Any monster sent from the hand or the main deck to the graveyard. Wow, Traveler. And summon that Dante back. <laughs> Soul Charge is a trap. <laughs> you used to never see that card in Burning Bits when they're at their prime now. I know, right? It looks so broken. Mm-hmm. <laughs> mm-hmm. Any Burning Bits monster they sent there to the grave at this turn, go ahead and summon them all back. Like, yep. Like, nothing even happened. Mm-hmm. <laughs> oh, is the stalling gonna be real? Like, New York Jets, I'm waiting for you to actually, like, get into this duel. Even if you had to, like, pitch, summon Beatrice, crash in a Trish, summon Fusion Dante, and then run, run, run over the Trish, you can do that. You can always do that, sir. Like, where is Beatrice? I know you got her in there. There's really no point in really playing Burning Abyss, unless you have her now. Like, that, that just sparked, like, mm -hmm. just a brand new play in Burning Abyss. Maybe. I haven't even seen uh, Virgil either. Like, where is uh, Rubik? Rubik, I haven't seen him all duel. <laughs> Can't be destroyed with a battle. Unless you have some kind of plan. That decoration is fine. I know he used Beyond. That's the whole point. He, did, he literally <laughs> did the same exact fucking play that he did last duel. Beyond. Yep. This man's cute with it. This man Graf knows knows how to handle the burning abyss. Because his name is Graf. <laughs> <laughs> so now what? the reason why. So that, you could always done that. Like, what did he use? I don't think he used Beyond. Oh. Here's Graf. Again. I'm not even sure if burning abyss really need a hit. I think they're okay for right now. Mm. Oh, okay. Let's see the watchers chat. No, let me look. Mm. Sure. Okay, we'll... yeah, yeah, I see. Sure, we'll go with that. Sure. Yeah. Sure. Sure. Wink. <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, now what? I mean, you're not going to use Dante effect. You're just going to just kind of sit there and try to float and survive. I said, I was told you pitched, went into Beatrice, crashed Beatrice, summoned out uh, Pilgrim Dante, and then I was going to turn them beer that couldn't be targeted. Ran over that Trish. Now, how, how are you going to handle uh, Herald of Arclight? I mean, you're on your own on that one. Maybe Fire Lake, I guess? <laughs> <laughs> I haven't seen much of Fire Lake either. This duel is going so slow now because nothing's happening. Yeah. <laughs> it's like he can't mill, he can't do anything. Oh, okay. So I guess when he kills the Dante, he'll get get back the Dante, the Sir, and the Graph, and the Sir and the Graph will get their effects. Is that the plan? So flowy. Just <laughs> get it over with. So I guess that's the reason why you're playing more Traveler. It's because you only have one Graph and two Sir. Yes, sir. Uh, uh, Leave. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> like, Graf, are you just not drawing anything to handle the situation? I would are, you just, you... are you just not drawing a line, Graf? I, I... Leave. <laughs> Seriously thought that he would have busted out a, a, a Axia by now. So floaty. As soon as he gets rid of it. I couldn't think of a pun to make with Baxia. <laughs> you better get Bax to summon in those Baxias. I don't know. That one was that one wasn't even 
a pun, really. It's just crap. <laughs> You're like, I'll leave it now. I'm gonna pretend that one didn't happen. Not right. <laughs> Alright, go ahead and grab the chicken game. Gonna go ahead and get rid of it like last time. The thing is that he doesn't even need to use Harold to negate shit. <laughs> he could, <laughs> but he doesn't need to. <laughs> Please, Grass, go ahead and bust out that next. You don't have to worry about Fire Lake. You know that there's a Traveler set. Just that Dante, though. Like Even spinning him back to the deck, he's still going to get Extreme Tales. Can you go into Dole? <laughs> Dole would be wonderful, even though he would still have Traveler. Like, nah, man, this is the floatiness, the power of floating. That's it? Oh, oh. <laughs> Professionalism. Yeah. <laughs> Someone left a comment on the YouTube video and then I opened up the video. And then that was an ad. <laughs> She's like, no, you know, click an ad makes me the money. <laughs> What are you? Yeah. BP Yu Gi Oh! Yeah. Hmm. Hmm. Yep, so, break the scale of your Herald of Arclight and. Mill. <laughs> Alright. So, this duel shall go on forever. We're already starting to go. We're gonna get going to time soon. <laughs> <laughs> Detach sort of graph. Mm, I don't believe so. What was it? Bixie. Okay, so it's unaffected by traps. What was it? She went Bixie and uh, Zephyr. Zephyr Nui. Nui. Go ahead and catch that Regeki though. So fair. So fair. I I really do feel like we should just go back to what OCG has. Mm. Like, why do we have two Dark Holes and Regeki? <laughs> well, I guess they have tr three Toronto Tribute, so. So who's the crazy one now? <laughs> <laughs> I'm Monster Rebel. Mm hmm. Monster Born's st still broken. It is straight up just an enabler. It's just like, oh, I don't have game. Well, let me go ahead and monster born a monster and then attack for game anyway. Ah, there she is. I've been waiting for her this entire damn duel. Beatrice. She's pretty cheap. Kind of need one from my Doom Shaman. That from my Super Vicey Bell now. Still working on it. I just, just didn't want to seem to cooperate with me on DN. <laughs> mm. What a turnaround. Hey, that's what Regeki does, right? Just turnaround duels. At least he can't take any more damage. <laughs> He's 100 points straight. Little chicken game. Yeah. Like he won't pay a thousand to strike, then go for game. <laughs> Uh, Graf, can you come back? A nice back seer, maybe. Mm -hmm. If only you would have used, like, Gia as a material and went into Chao Feng. <laughs> mm -hmm. Just Chao, Chao Feng, Chi Wen, that's all that good shit. <laughs> and they gave them dark and light. Mostly darks. Nah, he's just gonna scoop. Alright, and I guess we're going to game three in a super long Deando commentary. <laughs> Holy crap, be right back. Alright, we are back. So, I guess maybe Deando commentary. It seems like it's like one really long Deando commentary per week and then one short one. <laughs> <laughs> These marathon ass duels. So, what does he do? Like three chicken game, three oracle, and three terraforming, I guess? Probably. I'd say, I, I don't think you're running any Sky Arc or anything along those lines. I haven't seen none of that. 
And then it's the Fraxy. <laughs> But didn't he try to play that one that looks like Exiton? Oh, oh that's the Sky Iris. There it is. Talk of the Devil. Or oh, Sky Iris. If he would have played that, wouldn't he be locked out of summoning Yang Pendulum summoning Yang Zing monsters, though? But I guess his opponent was like, nah, Final Providence, let me go ahead and negate that. I don't want you to get that. <laughs> I don't <laughs> want to lock you out of Pendulum summoning Yang Zings and you can only summon Zephyr. Because what is, what is that, Teller in... Uh, Zephyr? Him? Uh, what, the, uh... The x Yeah, looking. the x dude, yeah. yeah. Teller. Yep. Yeah, that would have locked him out, yeah. Mm -hmm. Pitch, pitch, summon, summon. Wow. I mean, it doesn't really matter, because it's probably just only, he only wants to pinch and summon them back from the extra deck anyway, which are only going to be Zephyrus. So I guess you don't need them as the pendulum scales this time. Okay, I'm trying to figure out where you're going with this. Are right, you go back. Summon, I guess, Baxia? Yeah. Get your search on, right? Yep. Unless he doesn't want it. Why do you not want it? You can add. Doesn't grab that, it. grab that little spear. That trap. Uh, I guess he doesn't want it. He's not getting it. He's looking at his graveyard. I guess he'll get it. Maybe he'll set up his Pendulum Scales and Pendulum Summon it. No, you don't get it when it's user Synchro Joe. When it's Pendulum Summon or when it's destroyed by Battle by Card Effects. Oh, okay. So. It was one of the two it's sequences. Been, it's been so long since I played Zephra. <laughs> so. I guess Pop and Summon. I see. I see. I thought you were going to bounce, b bust out the Chao Fang with Gia and just negate all Dark Monster effects. That would have been pretty powerful. Not sure if you have any level 5, so... You could have did, like, what? Gia... Then... I don't know, Gia... Beyond, and then a level 5, but I guess I'm not sure if you have a level 5 in here. What's the, the other Zephyr guy? I don't, I don't know how strong he is. Oh, wow. Nice. Yep, nice. Like it. <laughs> Listen, you don't see that every day. Mm -mm. And you them summon, get your search. Now I'll search for your counter trap card, I guess. Yep. So you could go Yazzy, Yazzy into Chelfang. No, nah, okay. he did that the wrong way. That's no, I guess he wants another box, wants... yeah. yeah. Yeah, I was going to say, if he wanted to make Chao Fang, that was the wrong way. <laughs> you better not do it. You better not make Chao Fang. Second box, yeah. Oh, okay. The Blaze! Going to freaking Herald, Herald for Herald another again. time. Oh my god. GG, scoop it up. <laughs> oh, Herald plus Chao Fang would be amazing. Mm-hmm. God, this deck count is freaking BA so hard. Yeah, he is learning how to do it. Like, holy crap. What do you even do in this situation? You good? Play light imprisoning. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, there's a lot of lights going on here. So he is playing it. I mean, I guess it's not terrible to play. So that's a lot of field spells. So I'm definitely triple chicken. Terraform and terrible. having a freaking field day. Mm -hmm. Get it? Field day. <laughs> that one wasn't even an intentional pun. <laughs> I hate you so much. <laughs> the puns just run it by blood. Wow. <laughs> He is. He is, he just went off that time. <laughs> That's probably one of the most impressive first turn Yang Zing plays I've ever seen. Yeah, that's crazy. Yeah, that was his first turn, damn. 
<laughs> Dog. <Crap. laughs> At it again with the Beyond Herald. <laughs> so, uh, you can't mail. We can mail. You just get banished. Like, I have no idea where you're going to go with this, New York Jets. Scoop. <laughs> Andy has the strike. Just ready to F you up. Someone, sir. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Go farf. Hmm, is that okay? I, I'd say it's okay. Just wait for something to threaten you. No, that's fine. It's not even worth the strike because you could just special summon a different burn you just like. Oh, that's fine. Oh man, farf is a scary looking demon, man. <laughs> I've never really, like, the artwork work is better on here than on like DN uh than on like Yu-Gi-Oh Pro and stuff. Yep, that's fine. I've never really looked at the BAs that closely. God, they're creepy. <laughs> He's got like no eyes. Ah, oh. it's weird. <laughs> Dante, can you catch mill? So I don't know where you're gonna go. Well, I guess if you want to mill, you just mill one just to get Sir in the in the grave to float. No, because you won't have anything to summon with Sir. I keep on mixing Sir up with Graf. <laughs> so I guess when Dante dies, then Sir can summon back Dante, and Dante can get back Sir. And then I guess it just tests us to. Oh. Ooh. Hold that back row. Right. Yeah. 28 booty. <laughs> Those are some dolphins. <laughs> oh. Okay. I guess I'll pop that before he pops my back row. And gets the banner banish, right? Well, gets the banish. The false? No, he already used the effect, remember? Oh, oh he yeah, he did. He special Right, oh. if he did that the other way around, though, couldn't he have got rid of the Herald's invincibility? Yep. Yeah, that was a bit he could silly have got rid of, of the Herald's invincibility. That was a bit silly of him. <laughs> See, this normal summon Farf, but summon Graf. Go into that, detach, pop, Farf, banish. Come back, sure, but now you lost your invincibility. You already established this in game one. And you could have just killed it with anything, really. <laughs> yeah. A faint gust of wind. <laughs> so, uh, how are you going to get over that 20, 28 booty? You got a Yang Zing? You can summon, pop, and deal. Uh, what do you have in your hand? You have your Pendrum Scale 1 guy, right? Is that level four? He's level four, right? The Zephyr the, whatever his name is? Oh, yep. And he has the freaking counter trap to stop your back row. Like, oh, I think you're in trouble in New York yeah. Jets. I think. You can only use your effect during either post turn if you have the blue ranger as a material, right? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> so, I guess you can go ahead and could trish this man. God, I'd hate to play Yang Zing keeping freaking track of which ones have which effects on. What do you mean which ones have which effects? Like, when, when you summon them, because you summon them, they get effects from the guys you summon them with, you know? Oh. The Sigma summon. Oh, yeah. I'd hate I'd to hate do that. To, yeah, I'd I'd hate to forgetting that you can, uh, Sucro summon during your opponent's turn. <laughs> yeah. I always forget that. <laughs> it's, it's nice having Yu Gi Oh! Pro. <laughs> Do all that for me. Yeah, you, you want to select uh, Gia. Gia and Swanee. Is that really how you pronounce that? Giatu and Swanee? Yeah. I believe that's. What? Well, Gia. Giatu. Giao? Giga Gia. I, I think it's Giatu. Mewtwo? <laughs> Jirachi Mewtwo? Wow, you're actually going to tribute? I thought you were just going to use your counter trap. I guess you can wrap this duel up, maybe, so. 
Oh, this is where he searches his ritual spell. <laughs> I don't like Shadow Me too. I was secretly playing. Oh yeah, I'm not a huge fan of him either. I haven't played actual Me too yet because that requires you to do the story mode. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I got I got all the way out of D League or whatever, and I'm in C League. <laughs> but it's like. So boring. I haven't lost a single game. The AI is so dumb. Mm -hmm. So boring and tedious. Yeah. It takes like freaking eight games just to get into the. Well, well like, it's an exaggeration. Probably like five wins just to get into the tournament where you have to win another two times. Mm -hmm. And it's not hard winning. It's easy as hell, which makes it so boring. <laughs> I've got a 100% win rate on my account. Online or just on? Uh, the on the story mode. Oh. I haven't played online yet. Okay, you won't get bodied. <laughs> this. Okay. I played against my friends when I uh, got to you. Okay, so. Pop you, summon. Get back you, summon you, Sawani, sure. Where are we going with this? <laughs> can you wrap this duel up? Can you, like. <laughs> can you, like, trish this man? I don't think so. I do like uh, about Shadow Me Too though. I do like the sandwich combos, with <laughs> the uh, the little beam of light you make behind them, mm -hmm. and then you just hit them into it, and they bounce back at you. Target. Okay. He never states his target. <laughs> yeah. He doesn't know. Just win already! Summon your Zephyr Young Zing guy and then go into. Yep. Trish this man. Yep. Oh, attack position for maximum BM. <laughs> well, it has to be in attack position. Oh, does it? Yeah. Because it's Geofact. Oh, okay. So, yeah, yeah. So, Trish him, I guess. Here it is. Even though Sir will summon back the grass and grass will banish from your monsters and all that cute shenanigans. Yep. Bye bye. Oh no, you could just banish the Farfa. And then he won't have a target for Sir. Don't banish Sir. He'll st apparently he'll still go off. I didn't even notice that. Know that. Oh, and I'm cutting your hand. And that's 27, 23. That's not game. <laughs> like 5,000. Do any of them have a 500 piece? 7,300. Do they? I don't remember seeing so one. Don't know. Don't know. I don't think so. Just summon it at one point, but I don't know if he. No. Oh. Guess not. He would need two 500 boosts. Like, no. XZ summon. Let's go. He could. <laughs> Bust out like a Felgrand or something? Those backseas are putting in too much work now. <laughs> oh, he actually is! Oh, I called it. I called it. You're gonna go into? Yeah! I, I was thinking that in my head. What spells do burn the best play? Exactly. It doesn't seem great, but you know. <laughs> He's doing it for BM. Like, he already banished the foolish, like, what else? <laughs> BM. Oh, I guess Regeki. Yep. Oh, yeah. Nope. <laughs> and, it, and it gives him more, uh. More. Like, because this has higher attack than a Baxia does. A Baxia could just be ran over by a Dante. Hmm. Okay, I always negate it, but he might have another brain give it special summon that, then XC, and then banish you. No, you're gonna oh, he's it. doing it. Uh, you're gonna use it now, okay. For so, glory. So I should summon another brain of this monster if you have it? If not, then that's definitely game. <laughs> Even if he does, it's still probably game. Yeah, that's game. Oh my god, it's finally over, people. Holy crap, that was a good game, though. That was a really good game. Yeah. Freaking 50 minutes. <laughs> Jesus. So I hope that you guys enjoyed this long ass Dando commentary. Uh, thank you, Mr. Oh my god. <laughs> thank you, Mr. Luna, for joining me. No problem. 
Thanks for watching. Thanks for the support. See you guys on Thursday with another DM Dill commentary. Thank you.